several European Union member states have special territories which, for historical, geographical, or political reasons, enjoy special status within or outside the European Union. These statuses have a wide range of derogation from EU policies. Most of the territories which are outside the EU nonetheless have a special relationship with the EU. The outermost regions are geographic areas which are part of a European Union member state, are situated outside of Europe, and are fully part of the EU. According to the Treaty on the Functioning of the European Union, both primary and secondary European Union law applies automatically to these territories, with possible derogations to take account of their structural social and economic situation, which is compounded by their remoteness, insularity, small size, difficult topography and climate, economic dependence on a few products, the permanence and combination of which severely restrain their development. There were seven outermost regions. As of the signing of the Maastricht Treaty in 1992, the Treaty of Lisbon included two additional territories in 2007, both of which seceded from one of the original outermost regions. St. Pierre till the copyright claim changed its status from OMR to OCT with effect from 1 January 2012, while Mayo joined as a new French OMR with effect from 1 January 2014. As of April 2014, a total of nine territories were registered to have OMR status. Azores and Madeira are two groups of Portuguese islands in the Atlantic. Their territory is an integral part of the Portuguese Republic, but both the Azores and Madeira have the special status of autonomous regions within the otherwise unitary Portuguese state. While derogations from the application of EU law could apply, none do. Their VAT is lower than the rest of Portugal but they are not outside the European Union value-added tax area. The Canary Islands are a Spanish archipelago off the African coast which forms one of the Spanish autonomous communities, thus having the status of being part of Spanish territory. They are outside the European Union value-added tax area. The Canary Islands are the most populated and economically strongest territory of all the outermost regions in the European Union. The outermost region's office for support and information is located in these islands, in the city of Las Palmas de Gran Canaria. French Guiana, Guadeloupe, Martinique, Mayotte, and Aratel de Copyright Union are five French overseas regions which under French law are, for the most part, treated as integral parts of the Republic. The euro is legal tender, and they are part of the European Union Customs Union. However they are outside the Schengen area and the VAT area. Mayotte is the newest of the five overseas departments having changed from an overseas collectivity, with OCT status, on 31 March 2011. It became an outermost region, and thus part of the EU on 1 January 2014. On 22 February 2007, St. Martin was broken away from the French overseas department of Guadeloupe, to be formed into a new overseas collectivity. As a consequence CEU status was unclear for a time. While a report issued by the French Parliament suggested that the island remained within the EU as an outermost region, European Commission documents listed it as being outside the European community. The legal status of the island was clarified on the coming into force of the Lisbon Treaty which lists it as an outermost region. The overseas countries and territories are dependent territories that have a special relationship with one of the member states of the EU and have been explicitly invited by the EU Treaty to join the EU OCT Association. They were listed in Annex to Act. To Article 198 of the Treaty on the Functioning of the European Union, which aside from inviting them to join OCTA, also provided them the opportunity to opt into EU provisions on the freedom of movement for workers and freedom of establishment. They are not subject to the EU's common external customs tariffs, but may claim customs on goods imported from the EU on a non-discriminatory basis. They are not part of the EU, and the EU acquis does not apply to them, though those joining OCTA are required to respect the detailed rules and procedures outlined by this association agreement. 
Opt members are entitled to ask for EU financial support.